everyone welcome to another video of mine today i'm going to be showing you what i bought my husband for christmas this year now we don't typically buy presents for each other but i always like to wrap something for him under the tree anyways even though we say don't buy any presents this year i just can't help myself i love giving so much so i just want to show you the gifts that i picked up for him this year to give you guys some ideas if you still have to buy the male figure in your life a gift so let's get into it and I'm going to show you exactly what I got my husband this year. Before we start, if you are new to my channel, hi, welcome. My name's Sylvana and I do mummy kid lifestyle type videos. So if you're interested in that sort of content, please consider subscribing to my channel. And if you like this particular video, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up before you X out. Let's get into it. The first thing I got him is a little rashy shirt. Should mention that I do live in Australia, so this time of year it is summer. So this is why I've gone for like swimmers for his gift. If you're wondering like why am I buying swimmers? Um, Cause obviously overseas, um, it's all winter and it's probably snowing over there, but, but it's summer here in Australia So I bought kind of like summer related things. So sorry that doesn't apply to you, but they're still great gifts to give anyways So the first thing like I said is like a rashy shirt. So he's never had a rashy shirt before um, But I find as we're getting older now I really do want to make sure that we're protecting our skin from this harsh Australian UV rays um, that we have here and making sure we can prolong our life as much as we can and you know avoid skin cancers and things like that so um, he was talking about getting a rashy shirt himself um, so I thought I might as well pick one up for Christmas um, as a gift instead so here is the one I picked up and this is um, one I got just from Target so it's the piping hot brand and it's just black and gray and this was in the size large and it was $25 like I said from Target so that's the rashy shirt there and to go with that of course I just got him some board shorts um, or swing shorts and this is what they look like here so they've got the same kind of color scheme with the black gray and white and these were also from Target and they are fifth or they were fifteen dollars so i thought he would get a lot of use out of these for summer this season so that's the first thing he is getting the next thing he's getting is kind of random but i always like to put these in his gifts um don't know why you can never have enough socks so i got him a three pack of converse socks so you get a gray pair a white pair and a navy blue pair and I just picked this pack up from TK Maxx, if that will focus, come on, there we go. Um, so I just got this pack from TK Maxx and they were $12.95. You can't go wrong with socks, even in summer, um, he still wears socks with like joggers or dressy shoes if we're going out for dinner and things like that. So you can never have enough socks in my opinion. And for some reason, guys always tend to get holes in their socks a lot faster than girls i don't know what it is are they more active than us or something i don't know um but yeah so three pairs of socks the next thing i've got is probably another random gift i think all of these are quite random gifts um it's things that he probably wouldn't buy himself so we are always fighting over with it so we are always fighting over where our iphone charger is and for some reason we always end up with just one in the whole house and then we're fighting over who's going to charge their phone up first so of course i picked him up his own iphone charger so this is just the cord we have plenty of those little adapter things anyways um so i picked him up a blue one so he knows this one is his because we've got a whole heap of white ones in the house and for some reason we are losing them somewhere i don't know where they're going but we are losing them so i got him a blue one to make sure um, he knows this one is his. I won't take it off him and perhaps because it's blue we won't lose it. I don't know. And to go with that, which is really cool and I think I want one of these myself, is this wireless charging pod. So I've never used one of these before and this one's just from Kmart. This was $20. Um, but I'm assuming you just charge... So there is a core that you get with this. I'm assuming you just charge this little device here 
um, and that will then charge your phone. So you can just sit it on like a bench or a table and then sit your phone on top of it and then it will charge your phone instead of plugging it in. So again, if we can't find our chargers, you can use this one instead. So yeah, pretty cool. I'll probably end up using this one as well and we can share the gifts. So I really want to get one of these myself. We'll see how it goes. If it is a hit, then I'll definitely pick up another one for myself. The next thing are all kind of like hygiene and I'm not trying to give him these gifts to say that, you know, he's smelly or he needs, you know, some extra help in that department. Um, again, these are just things that he probably will buy himself or even things that he wouldn't buy himself. And I thought it would be a nice trick for him to have. So the first thing I got him, and again, this might be kind of like an insult to some men, but for my husband, he's all good with me buying stuff like this for him. Since he's 35 and now he's tending to get longer hairs around the nose and the ears and things like that. And you know, we're, we don't stay young forever so we need to look after ourselves and our hygiene and how we look. So I picked him up this nose, ear and eyebrow trimmer. So this is the Remington brand and it looks like this. So it's just a simple little trimmer. Um, and it's got like a little charger in the back there. So, and I believe this was $15 from Target. Um, so, yeah, I should mention I did buy him this little toiletry bag first. So I'm going to be putting all the things I'm going to show you now um, into this bag. So um, I'm only going to wrap the bag with all the goodies already inside. So he's going to think he's just going to get a bag and think, why are you giving me a bag for Christmas? Um, but in actual fact, I've got a whole heap of stuff in here for him. So this again was from Target. I think was it, and I think this was around twenty dollars. I want to say mm -hmm. this is the Redstone brand, and it's like a plaid leather look to it. Really nice soft material, and it just has a basic zip on the top there. So I'll just stick into this bag and I'll show you what goodies will be inside. So the first thing, like I said, is the nose trimmer. So I've already showed you that, but that will be going in the bag. The next thing, again, kind of hand in hand with that, I got this thing here. And you're probably wondering what on earth is this because there's no package with it. And that's because I bought this thing from eBay. This was only like $2.40 and it's one of those bead catching aprons i think they're called i will insert a photo somewhere here on the screen to show you what it actually looks like um but basically it's got these little suction clips um on this apron where you can where you can suction it to like a mirror in your bathroom and then you get and then you tie the apron around your neck so as you're you know shaving your beard or your facial hair um all the clippings end up going onto the apron and not all over the bathroom sink because I'm so sick of cleaning up little clips of hair everywhere from my husband's beard. Even though he tries super hard to clean it up himself, for some reason there's always a whole heap left when I go back in there to use the bathroom after he has used it. So I thought this will solve that problem. Um, so yeah, something fun, something interesting. We'll see if he uses it. I hope he does use it um, because like I said, I'm really sick of cleaning up his little beard hairs from all over the sink. All right, let's keep diving into this bag. He's also getting two um, body sprays. So this is the Lynx brand. He always, always runs out of these. He usually has one in his car and one at home. Um, but for some reason, they go so, so fast. He clearly loves his body sprays. Um, so I picked him up two. These were on sale, I believe. They had a buy one, get the other one. No, they had buy two for a certain amount of money. I think it was buy two for seven dollars. Um, so this is the black um, scent, and the other one is Apollo. So two little body sprays. The next thing he's getting is this urban mess putty for his hair. So this is like a is it like a wax or a gel? Hmm. It doesn't actually say. It says putty. So what's putty? Is it a is it a wax or a gel? I'm not too sure. But hopefully he likes this one. So he loves to put gel in his hair um, and and to style like that. He likes to wear it long or longish, like on top. He likes to spike it on top. He's always done that hairstyle, so he definitely does need some gel or wax to keep it up there. 
So I got him this one. This one's just from Target as well. I think it was $8. So we'll see how he likes this one. The next thing I got him was actually from the same brand as that putty and it's the Urban Mess age defense moisturizer this is the anti-wrinkle one like i said my husband is 35 years old now so um i really want to encourage him to look after himself not that aging is something to be ashamed of but you know if we can look after our skin um why why not so um yeah i got him this anti-wrinkle um age defined moisturizer for men so again this is the same brand as that putty that I got him and again this was from Target and it was eight dollars and the very last thing in here again some men might be offended by this purchase but I'm very comfortable with buying my husband this we've been looking for these types of products for a little while now so I'm sure he won't mind me buying this for him so this is a hair growth tonic for men and it's one that I got from Priceline actually and this is pretty expensive so this was $59 just for this little bottle here but I read some really good reviews on this and I also asked the sales assistant she said this is the most popular hair growth um, product or tonic that they actually sell there so I thought I might as well give it a go and see how he finds it we actually tried the mix on is it the Nixon brand um, at Price Attack where you get the shampoo condition and then and then the like spray thing for your hair um, after you have washed it and even though it made his hair grow faster it didn't actually um, it didn't actually make his hair that he's lost grow back if that makes any sense so so he has a quite a lot of hair but he's losing like the thickness of it on top so he just wants to try and get that back because he's always had a lot of hair and a lot of thick hair as well so he just wants to get what he had back if that's possible so a lot of the hair growth products only make your hair um hair that you already have thicker rather than regrowing it from the roots so, but this one apparently um it, it actually encourages new growth so we'll see how he finds this. If it's any good, I'll let you guys know. I might let you know in like an Instagram story. So if you want to check back and see how he found this. But like I said, I read heaps of great reviews on this. So hopefully it does the trick. I mean, it was $59. So I hope it does work. It wasn't a cheap purchase. So this bag is now empty. So that means that is the end of all the gifts that I'm getting him this year. I hope you found it helpful and given you some ideas. Again, we don't normally buy presents, but these are just things he probably would buy himself or things that he probably wouldn't think to buy himself. So I thought it'd be a nice little treat for him anyways. So again, I hope you have liked it. If you have, again, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Subscribe down below to see more videos from me. And I hope you all have a lovely Christmas. I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Bye.